Hey everyone, Lovely Moon Bunny here, and today I am making a daycare, and I am so excited about this, guys. Ever since toddlers have been here, I have just been in love with them. They are so freaking cute. It's not even something that I really like was like die hard. I want toddlers. I know there were so many people out there that was like, I want toddlers. Where are they? Why haven't they gotten here yet? I mean, they definitely were worth the wait to me. They are so awesome and so fun, but I wasn't even like that intense. Like I want toddlers. And now that they're here, I'm just like dying all the time. Every time I see them, they're just so freaking cute. And all of the new items that came with them are just so adorable. And so, I went ahead and I did the video with Dustin. We kind of did a little mini like build when we did that. We just kind of did a real quick room uh, for us to play with the toddlers in while we were testing everything. But I was like, I really want to make a daycare. And I've seen people doing the toddler challenge. Actually, Dustin is doing it because Dustin has finally started his own gaming channel, guys. I finally convinced him. I know some of you out there who watched my channel were trying to convince him also. So he has finally started it and he's starting off with the toddler challenge, which is just hilarious. I went ahead and recorded a couple videos with him. You'll see me over on his channel too, but he's doing the toddler challenge and I was like, okay, I definitely have to make a daycare for him. So he's using this daycare in his toddler challenge. So we kind of got to play test it and see how it works. And guys, I got to say it actually works really well. The big problem I've seen other people having is when there's a two story house, it is impossible to take all of the kids upstairs, get them in bed, take them all back downstairs. Going up and down the stairs was just definitely an issue because things just take a really long time to do. I was like, I want to do something that is all one level. So that was the goal. I wanted everything to be one level. And actually this daycare is kind of inspired by the daycare I went to when I was younger because it was this kind of same shape. That's why I, how I got the idea for it. So the middle of the, the area was like the main rooms and then on the outside were like extra rooms so basically like art room or we had a theater room we had like a room with like a pool table we had all different rooms on the outside but it was basically like an octagon inside an octagon and so that's kind of how i came up with this idea it's a little bit different and i love how it came out i wanted to make sure there was everything there could possibly be to satisfy all the needs of the toddlers and to where it was really easy to get around and i wanted it to be super colorful and super cute so i used as many items that they added for these toddlers as i could i even Got to use some of the wallpapers and the doors, guys. The doors are so cute. I know that sounds so weird, but all the doors are adorable. The rainbow doors, the doors with the little unicorn and monster on them. They are all so cute. And I didn't really get to look at those when we when we originally played uh, just testing out toddlers. I didn't even realize there were wallpapers. And I was like, oh my gosh, we totally missed the wallpapers. So I used like all the different wallpapers I could, the ones that were my favorites. Uh, I definitely really love the one with the little like speckles. I don't know what to call them, like little dots. It reminds me of those paper lanterns when you like release them into the sky, how they kind of look like little squares like floating in this in the sky. That's kind of what it looks like to me. And I freaking love that wallpaper. So that one's in there. Um, I used everything I could, guys. I am really happy with how this came out. I even had a lot of fun with the outside. I added some monkey bars. I don't know what all the toddlers can use. I don't know if they can get on the monkey bars, but I made a little sandbox for them. I have a pool there. I don't know if they can use the pool. Um, we'll see what happens with that. I don't know if they can or not. I don't know if you can like teach them to swim. I just used everything I possibly could. I wanted to make it super fun and super cute. And I put the stuffed animals the big stuffed animals I blew them up even bigger on the outside and I love how it came out I like stacked them together 
Um, so yeah, I just, I love how this daycare came out. And so I hope you guys enjoy it. If you use it, I think it works really well for the toddler challenge so far. Um, since I've played with Dustin while he's been doing it and it's just really worked out really well. So I hope you guys like it. I will have it on the gallery and I will put the link below for you guys to use it if you want to. If you do guys, please let me know if you're using, um, anything I create, even Sims that I have on there, just totally like tag me in it. I want to see y'all's videos. I love seeing what you guys do too. And so if you use this daycare, definitely tag me on Twitter or on whatever you use to tag me. Um, I have like all my social medias on my channel that you can find all the links. Um, so you can tag me in whatever and I will definitely go check it out and maybe share it too. So <laughs> definitely let me know. But I hope you guys enjoy this video. I'm going to stop rambling on. I really hope you like it. I am so happy with how it came out. If you did, please remember to give this a thumbs up and I will see you guys next time.